Hi everybody, this is Kevin Purcell for Notebooks.com. Let's say you're trying to work in a multi-operating system environment. In other words, you've got both a Mac OS X computer and maybe a Windows PC as well. And you want to copy files back and forth. Well, there's a lot of ways to do it, but one of the simplest ways is just simply plug in a USB thumb drive or a USB external hard drive into the computer and copy it over. Maybe you're really new at this computer thing and you're not really sure how to copy a file. So we're going to show you how to do that real quick. Well, here we are. Let's say we've been working in our Word document. We choose Save. And we had previously saved it to the desktop. I'll show you how you do that. You just go up here to File, Save As. Make sure Desktop is highlighted over here. And then hit Save down here. Now we've already done it, so it's already there. So we'll have to hit Replace. If you haven't already done it, that won't show up. Now we'll move that down. After you've plugged in your USB thumb drive into the computer, over here on this side you're going to have what looks like a little white hard drive and it'll show the name of that thumb drive. We haven't given our thumb drive a name, so it's called No Name. What you do is you just take that drive, or that document that you just created, and pull it over here and drop it on that thumb drive. Now you heard that sound because we had already done this previously, uh, so it was actually replacing it, and that just is like the sound that says, hey, we've just finished doing it. So there you have, you, no name is now on our thumb drive. The next thing we're going to do is show you on in Windows Explorer how to then copy that from Windows Explorer over to the Windows machine. Alright, so there you have it. We've just plugged it into our Windows computer. Now I know it looks the same as before I'm running Windows on Parallels on my Macintosh, but it works exactly the same as it would if you were doing this on your, uh, your Windows computer. It'll pop open this dialog box called Autoplay, and the thing to do, the simplest way to copy it over to your Windows computer is hit this little button. Now you see it's got a whole bunch of junk in here because we did it from a Macintosh. But just select this one down here that just says techworkshop.docx and you can just simply drag it to your desktop and see there it is, it's ready to go. The other option is if you want you can bring it over here to your documents folder and put it there. Now if you go in here and look at your documents folder drag down and there it should be right here. It's as simple as that. This has been Kevin Purcell for Notebooks.com showing you how to copy a file from a Mac computer to a Windows computer using a USB thumb drive. Thank you for watching.